eighth in the final, but I think when you get a chance to reflect on it, somewhere down the line, you'll be really pretty pleased with 3.32. Yeah, it's a two second PB, yeah. which is substantial. I thought if I'd run 3.32, I'd be a bit closer to the front, to be honest. That race was ridiculous. That was ridiculous. But I felt like I did everything I could, put myself in the right place. And I had nothing the last 200, I'd be, I was fighting to hold on. But that's just the way it goes, I mean, the level's so high just now, and when it goes fast from the gun, then all you can do is hang and hope. I did, I gave everything I could, and came away with the PB, not quite the result I wanted, but, I mean, yeah, gave it everything, as I said. You, you, you've had a roller coaster a few weeks anyway, because obviously yeah. you had the COVID just before uh, the Worlds, and then you were so close to reaching the final, and then you've had to pick yourself up, so in the end, did you say you're reasonably happy? You've still got the Europeans. Yeah. Reasonably happy, I suppose, when I reflect on it. it. A bit bittersweet just now because I really felt I was at a level where I could have been mixing it with the front guys. I wasn't there, um, despite running a big personal best. So, yeah, it's just a case of being happy that I have improved since World Champs. I'm back feeling a bit more like myself. Hopefully, in another couple of weeks, I'll do even better, but that'll be another battle in of itself. But, yeah, as I said, very sweet but overall can't be too disappointed.